<laughs> Boy, y'all see that mayor, what's her name, Tiffany, in that Dalton that, <laughs> in Chicago? Oh, man, she is, man, she running rough shot on that little town. Man, that, <clears throat> that little gal, that little gal bulldog in that town. I watch a little town day on there. Every business on the street is boarded up. <laughs> look like Detroit. Look like Detroit when, when the college dropped in Detroit. That's how I look like in that little town, Dalton. <laughs> she got everybody scared. <laughs> Heard her little police chief. They got everybody in that town shook, boy. See, I tell you, black folk, this is what happened when y'all want black leaders, right? Y'all always talking about we need a black mayor, we need a black governor. Y'all see what they do, don't you? They work the white folk. At least, you know, let me tell you about, at least white folk do this here. If white governor, mayor, at least when they steal money, they don't put up no billboards. They don't go to no casinos. They, you know, they just, they, they steal a little money, but they still take care of the citizens. You know, like I tell people, <laughs> when white folk, I, I want to be going by white folk. I don't want no black mayor. I don't want no black mayor. I don't want no black governor. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I don't want no black police chief. <laughs> we see how that is, don't you? Tiffany running rough shot. They say that girl got billboards <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> she moonwalking. She going to Las Vegas shooting crap, playing backgammon. <laughs> say, say they even got crap games going on in the, some of the abandoned, abandoned buildings there. She ain't no joke, boy. And she don't care. She don't care not one bit. They say the feds coming down. That, that gal ain't worried about no feds. She ain't worried about no feds. She got the police locked in. She got everything going her way. And the black folk, they trying to get out. Oh, they in board meetings. They talking they little talk. I just watched one little video when they had, I guess they had like a little meeting, a city council meeting. And everybody came so they to reach their little piece. And they had a police, they had a big, big black fat po police guy. He, he, he guarding the microphone, right? He, he letting them speak, but he watched Tiffany. If Tiffany gave him that look, that little three blinks, he cut the mic off and kicked their tails out. Oh, the people. That would have you black folk. That what y'all want. You know, I mean, I remember, I remember when, when Mayor Coleman Young died in Detroit, right? I kept telling people, you need a black mayor. I mean, you need a white mayor. Only thing gonna turn Detroit around is a white mayor. No, we want a black mayor. So what they got? They got Dennis. They got Dennis Archer in there after Coleman Young, right? <laughs> Dennis Archer said, "The hell with this. I'm getting the hell out of here. These people are crazy." Now, if Detroit would have got Dave Bean, Dave Bean was a bill man, a businessman. He owned. He was like Trump, you know, and he was clean. He played basketball of Detroit business, right? Dave Bean would have been a good man, but they didn't want Dave Bean. Oh, no. They say Dave Bean was too white. <laughs> that here Dave Bean, Dave Bean on Bean Steel, right? Businessman, he could have helped turn Detroit around because he had white connections. Let me tell you something. You ain't going to turn nothing around unless you got some white folks connection. Like I say, they'll look corrupt too, but they but they going to make it look really, really good. They're going to make the city look good. They're going to make sure it, they gonna, what I call trickle down corruption. OK, trickle down corruption is where they take some money from these 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 people like Trump and they build big businesses and they create industry and the money trickle down to the workers, to the people. But when you got <laughs> but you what you y'all seeing now, you seeing now with these black governors and these black mayors and they fleecing the whole town. They don't care nothing about the people. And the first thing they want to tell y'all is that they want to holler racism or they want to say, well, the white man do it. Well, at least when the white man do it, you make money, right? How much money we made when Trump was in office? Oh, we made all kind of money, didn't we? <laughs> but then look at Tiffany. The little girl Tiffany, she don't care. And she let y'all know, boy, she be riding her big escalades, having her little police escort. See, she they say that girl bought the whole police force, all new cars. Some police was working low. What the police were working like 80 hours a week. <laughs> she was paying up. Police is getting checks for five thousand dollars a week. <laughs> I'd be on her side too if I was a police officer. Man, what you niggas? I'm, I'm, I'm riding with the chief. <laughs> she got the police locked down. When you got the police locked down, boy, you got some power. No poor little people in that little dog. I watched the video. All the business. She, she, she was she was shaking down the businesses. They already paying taxes. Poor little people paying taxes, right? Right. They say the place is running like a two million dollar deficit, right? Because definitely took all the money and she just shook the businesses down so much that they bored enough. They can't they can't afford to pay the shakedown fee. At least, at least when the white men or or the, or the yakuza come in and shake it down, at least your community is good. They make sure you don't get broken into. 
good. You know, you get, you get good services, right? But no, old Tiffany, she got all police shaking the whole, shaking all the ministers down. Now, now them people in a food desert. Now, they got to go on the south side to buy chicken wings from the from the air store because they ain't got no food in their little town. And Tiffany ran all the businesses out the town. Oh, Tiffany, Tiffany. <laughs> Tiffany Alco. I'm telling y'all, when you get these black people in, in power, in a position of power, they do black folks worse than white folks do. <laughs> like I tell you about Detroit. <laughs> they, didn't, they didn't want they didn't want Dave Bean, right? Dave Bean could have helped tear the city around because he got the full connection, right? So what they do? They, <laughs> they got Dennis Archer. Not Dennis Archer, but they got Kwame Poor Patrick, right? And he fleeced the city. He fleeced the city big time. He was giving contracts out to all his folks. Now I know white folks do it too, but like I say, at least they take care of business. At least they take care of your business mate. When you your life is a little better and you not know you're being fleeced. See, that's good. When you're not know you're being fleeced. But when you being fleeced, that's different. Kwame Patrick came in, told the city, <laughs> fleeced the city, right? And Detroit finally got smart and they got that white, they got that white fella mayor in, right? Now he don't do too much for the outskirts of Detroit, right? But downtown Detroit, they tell me it's beautiful now. I gotta go back home probably next month. So I'll check it out for myself because I heard the nice cigar lounge down down Detroit. But they say downtown Detroit is nice, right? He brought me, got the guy from who owned the Cleveland Cavaliers, Quick and Loans. They built new stadiums. They had four built new stadiums, right? And they making money. Downtown Detroit is beautiful, right? They even got a marathon down <laughs> last week I saw. I'm like, what? A marathon down? <laughs> the white folk running, jogging down the street in a marathon in Detroit. And ain't nobody shooting by, <laughs> shooting by at them. But that's inner city, and that's good. You got to start from inner city, bring the money in, and then spread it out. But the white man, he's going to bring money in, right? He's going to bring it buddy in and he gonna sell he gonna sell his brother his buddy laying in a building for like one dollar and they gonna put new windows in it they gonna put halls in it and put lights in it they gonna hire people you know in Detroit and around Detroit to go in there and work and help build the city back up right now he's still gonna fleece on the side right but he gonna build it up <laughs> that, that what the black folk these black people to get about that don't realize you can get into power but you got to do something and you got to make it look good you can't go to Tiffany Billboards. <laughs> she had billboards all. She got billboards all around the city like she Big Meech. <laughs> they say Big Meech. They say Big Meech. You, <laughs> you, you a Big Meech a drug dealer. He, he putting up billboards. <laughs> he, he only he, he didn't pay taxes. <laughs> so Tiffany putting up billboards everywhere like Big Meech. <laughs> uh, she fleecing them. Boy, they, boy, they hires a firecracker, boy. Tiffany. Oh, Tiffany, you wrong, Tiffany. At least, at least let the people open up a store, right? They gonna pay taxes, right? You can't shake down the stores, right? Oh, man, that's bad when the police come in there and shake the store down. <laughs> you ain't pay. You ain't paid. When that envelope fell, we get an envelope this week. Tiffany said we gotta shut you down. <laughs> I saw one little video with the little white fellow who be doing the hood videos. You know, he went there, you know, he went there, you know, you know, see, you know, <laughs> if it was a little black, black person with like a hood video blog, the police would have heard his tail out, right? But that little white boy, that little white, <laughs> white boy went there with a little camera, right? He going to try to help the black folks, right? Going to try to confront Tiffany, right? But he didn't get to Tiffany. Cause that <laughs> Tiffany right hand man, that, uh, that, 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 that police officer, whoever he is, <laughs> the one who said got that long rap sheet. <laughs> They say he be hauling people tails out. Them black police around that white boy. Now they ain't touch that white boy, right? If it was a little black boy, <laughs> they would have hauled his tail out. But they know they couldn't touch that little white boy, right? <laughs> that little white boy was defiant to him. Some some little white boy was saying to him, I say, boy, that'd have been a black <laughs> a, 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 they can't know how no video camera. They'd hold his tail out, right? They do it that little white boy though, but, but uh, that little white boy know that <laughs> you get mighty close, right? He thought he gonna come in there and ride in there and go, <laughs> and go say the black, black folks in Dalton. They ran his little tail out there too, right? Right? He ain't come back, all right? I'm telling you, Tiffany ain't no joke, but, but Tiffany, cut the people a break, right? <laughs> cut the, they tell me, we want you out. Want you. Tiffany ain't going nowhere. <laughs> they say Tiffany go to, she, she go to, she go to Las Vegas, spend $2 million on blackjack. <laughs> Give me 150 on red. <laughs> Tiffany, Tiffany ain't no joke, boy. I, what else you get that folks get? You know what y'all get? That's what y'all get. Y'all won't black. <laughs> and, and put it like this. The black women, when they get in power, it's worse than the black men. <laughs> oh, 
look at look at Fanny. Fanny, Fanny Willis got weighed hemmed up now, right? <laughs> Wade ain't got no job. It white about to lock, lock his tail up. He keeping his mouth closed because he trying to protect Fanny. Oh, them black women. Boy, I'll be telling you some more. And then that with the black man in Chicago, the Chicago got rid of that look. <laughs> that little sideways, cute, funny looking lady. What was her name? Pocahontas. <laughs> she had a little Indian name. <laughs> she looked like she was crazy as a busy bug. Chicago got rid of her. Hey, what Chicago do? They voted in <laughs> a black boy who just was crazy. <laughs> black vote. <laughs> well, I, I'm telling you something. If I see a black person on the ballot, I don't vote. <laughs> I don't vote for no black folk. Uh uh-uh. uh. Because you get, get a little power, boy. They go crazy with power and they'll do nothing for their people, boy. But Tiffany. Cut the people in Dalton a little break, right? Stop shaking everybody down, right? I mean, people got to go where the Chicago South Side to buy the chicken wings from the from the A-Rail from the A-Rail because they can't buy no chicken. They say in Dalton you can't you can't even open up a barbecue pit on Saturday night. Like people can do barbecue pits. They say Dalton you can't do that. You got to pay a shake down fee, poor police come. Where, where our money? Where our envelope at? <laughs> Shut you down. Oh boy, that's hard, boy. It's Tiffany, boy, Tiffany. Cut the people in Dalton to break, okay? <laughs> and take some of them billboards down. You ain't Big Meech. 